Setting up WPS, Curriculum, and Users. Connect the power cable to the input power block on the right side of the RealWeld system. Then start the RealWeld system by pressing the on-off button on the control panel. The machine will boot up like a standard desktop or laptop PC. The RealWeld software will automatically open and display on the monitor. Once the software is loaded, the user will be prompted to provide a username and password. The initial default instructor username and password can be obtained in the instruction manual. Separate passwords will be required later for the student mode and the instructor mode. Instructor mode, WPS. Let's learn how to work with Welding Procedure Specifications, or WPS. Press the WPS button to enter the Welding Procedure Specifications section of the instructor mode. An instructor can create, edit, and remove welding procedure specifications in the real weld. These specifications are categorized by type, joint, and position. Press the pull-down menu and select the joint and position of the desired weld. How to edit a WPS. Only recognized, logged-in instructors can edit a WPS. To begin an edit, select the correct WPS and press Open. This will bring you to the editable WPS screen, which contains all of the specifications and parameters of the weld. Edit specifications and parameters by pressing on the desired item and entering updated information. Save the edits by pressing the floppy disk icon on the top of the window and exit the WPS window. How to create a WPS. To create a WPS, press the New button. A prompt will appear asking the user to enter a title or name for the WPS. Enter the title and press OK. Select a process. Once a process has been selected, the various specifications and parameters related to that process will appear. Then, input all specifications and parameters for the related process. Save the WPS by pressing the floppy disk icon on the top of the window and exit the screen. How to remove a WPS. Remove a WPS by selecting it and pressing the Remove button. Press OK when asked to confirm if you want to remove the WPS. Curriculum. Pressing Curriculum will open up the Instructor Curriculum screen. This shows all the content curricula contained in the RealWeld Trainer. In this tab, an instructor can create, edit, and delete curricula. How to edit a curriculum. Select the curriculum you wish to edit. When selected, a list of available WPS within the curriculum are displayed on the right. To edit, press the Open button. In the Edit screen, an instructor can add, delete, and rearrange the order of the WPS in the curriculum. To add a WPS, press the plus page icon. Then, select the WPS to add using the drop-down menus. To remove a WPS, select it and press the X icon. To arrange the WPS order, select a WPS and use the up and down arrow icons. Be sure to save the changes you've made to the WPS by pressing the floppy disk icon. Then exit the edit screen. How to create a curriculum. Press the new button located on the bottom left. Enter a title or name for the curriculum. Once this is entered and you've pressed OK, you will be at the same screen as the Edit screen. Just as before, add the desired WPS to the curriculum using the plus page icon. When all WPS are in the curriculum, save the curriculum by pressing the floppy disk icon and exit. How to remove a curriculum. Select the curriculum to remove. Press the Remove button. Press OK when asked to confirm if you want to delete the curriculum. Users. Pressing the Users button will allow the instructor to view the entire user list. In the Users tab, the instructor can add, edit, and remove users and customize each user's curriculum. When selecting a user, Information about the user will appear on the right, such as username, user rights, system rights, first name, last name, email address,
curriculum and curriculum status. User edits. To edit information about a user, select the user and press the open button. This opens the user edit screen. From here, an instructor can change parameters about the user, such as user rights and curriculum. To select a different curriculum for the user, press the folder icon in the curriculum row. This will bring up all of the created curricula in the RealWorld system. Select the desired curriculum and press OK. To change the status of a particular WPS, select it and choose the appropriate status. Be sure to save your work by pressing the floppy disk icon and then exit. New User To create a new user, press the New button, then enter a username and press OK. Once this is done, it will bring you into the User Edit screen and you can edit the user's information exactly as before. Note, any field with an orange bar indicates that more information is needed. Save the new user by pressing the floppy disk icon and then exit. Deleting a user. To delete a user, select the user and press Remove. Press OK to confirm and delete the user. Thank you for taking the time to learn how to install and set up your new RealWeld system. If you have any questions, please contact us directly.